You mentioned earlier about covering up your Appalachian accent. Did you figure out later, like, you know, that's what makes me unique? <clears throat> yeah. And did you just start, you know, embracing it? Well, uh, I, when I speak, it's always been there. So I, I've never really tried to cover it up. I, my first year at college, when I left uh, Chapmanville High School, I got accepted into Baylor University. And I got on a plane and I left and I said, I'm never coming back. I'm going to where Pantera is at. And I remember when I went down there, the girls thought the you know the accent was kind of cute. So I was like, "Oh, I'm I'm rolling with this." <laughs> but I I've also noticed that when when I when we do a lot of touring and we go to areas where people don't hear a lot of uh, or the Appalachian accent, they really are in in it's endearing to them. It makes it soothing to them. They like they like the slower draw. So I don't play it up, but I don't cover it up. Now, when we sing, there is absolutely no way that my accent would affect the band's music in a positive way. Right. So it's, you know, it's got, I've got to sound like this dude that's from nowhere. Yeah. Yeah. Just nowhere. Just nowhere. Just a homogenous, like. Yeah, from the field of Braveheart, basically, <laughs> is, is the way I would say. 